my Virgo mind because he's a Leo and his What's your sign? Pisces. He always say, I know how Sagittarius is. Like, I mean, Pisces are known to be very deep, very emotional. But it's like, you gotta step out that shit. We Leo's. Think, baby, I'm Aquarius. I started this game to shit. It's Aquarius and a Scorpio. So I say, is it, is it a Sagittarius thing? Is it just me or does it seem like Gemini's have been running their mouths a lot lately? It's definitely not just me. These people are ruled by Mercury, the planet of communication, and I'm sure everyone can tell. Once these people get to talking, it is very hard for them to stop. This is because they think entirely too much. This time can sit and have a conversation with themselves and literally be tired afterwards. What Gemini needs to realize is that thinking is not doing. First, let's get into Gunna. His case in connection with the whole Young Thug indictment was literally a misdemeanor at the most, so everyone is wondering why he even took a plea deal in the first place. I can tell you right now that it is very likely he sat in jail for months and got stuck in his head as most Geminis do. He convinced himself that taking a deal would not make him a snitch because he really had nothing to do with the case. It is very easy for Geminis to convince themselves of things. And while missing very important points, the very important point being the feelings of others. If F your feelings was a person, it would definitely be a Gemini. We clearly know that Gunner is probably not involved in the crimes they say why is still committed. But to turn on your one of your closest friends and say a record label was a gang so you can get out, is just insane. Up next, we got Tommy Lee. She was on Love and Hip Hop Atlanta and she is currently on the new season of Baddies West on Zeus. Everything was going smooth while she was telling her side of the story regarding Chris Brown concert until she morphed into the other twin and said F the baby and his daddy. Listen. You don't know them and this shit gonna turn on you. And thank God he did that. Cause that shit would have been all in the news too. Tommy did something, Tommy did. Tommy ain't do nothing but say, ooh, that's a baby and a bitch slammed the door in my face quickly. And ain't no pressure, bitch, cool. I, I know how I am about my kids, bitch. You don't want nobody to see your baby, cool. I don't give a fuck about no motherfucking baby. Fuck your baby. And fuck his daddy, too. What the fuck? Gemini's are the sign of doubles. It's either double the fun or double the trouble. And it could be both. Even though gems are very much so aware that they have another personality, they are very embarrassed by it. And once they gain control of it, you will never see that twin. There are many evolved Geminis and they have literally learned to basically not say anything much in public and to just smile and nod. With all that being said, Geminis are still one of the most wanted signs in the Zodiac. And this is because they live in the air and they change with the wind. So they are very hard to catch. It is very hard for an unevolved Gemini to tell the difference between reality and fantasy. And they have no problem using their wires to cover up the real. Geminis truly believe that some people just can't handle the truth. And this is why some are considered to be liars. Do you think they care? Not. With Leo in their third house of communicating, they really don't believe in telling on themselves in any sense. And an apology is kinda like telling on yourself. And they truly always have a logical explanation of why they did what they did and why they said what they said. But who wants to hear logic when there are feelings involved? Nobody. I ain't mean that about the baby. I was hot. I was really, really hot trying to make a point. Like, I would not kick down a door by the baby. I love y'all. And, and I love Chris Brown and his baby. He's gorgeous. He gorgeous to me. When I say his eyes was caught like a pistol, I mean he got big eyes. And when I say albino, I ain't being racist. It is a, a such thing as albino. I love the baby. He have nothing to do with it. Y'all took it the wrong way. I'ma talk how I talk. I'ma be me. I'ma talk how I talk. I ain't copping no please. I love that baby. And I never disrespect no kids. But I was hot. I was hot. And I pray God forgive me. I already repented. He who was out, who he who without sin cast the first fucking stone. Now show me one. Somebody show me Jesus in here. I wanna see Jesus. I wanna see one of y'all without sin who ain't did no wrong. I ain't mean that about the baby. The most difficult thing for a Gemini to do is admit fault, say sorry, or say they were wrong at all. They may show you, but to actually say it is definitely progress. So we got to give Tommy some credit. Change is good. Over the past decade or so, we have all sat back and watched Ye be a true Gemini. 
and to the core because he isn't issuing out any apologies to anyone for anything and he has always said what is on his mind kanye is the epitome of an unevolved gemini for a few years he was actually quiet and when we would see him with Kim and his family, he would just smile and nod. But he fell off. And that happens. Gemini men can be very unbalanced. If you watched both of his Drink Champs interviews, then it is clear that these were not the same person. On the latest interview, look how the mean twin way. comes out of nowhere. You already fuck with me so much. You already black mirrored me. You already made everybody think I'm crazy. You already took my family away. You already separated all my friends. I don't got no celebrity friends. Because when I was on TV, on Instagram saying, I don't know where my child is. And the Kardashians kidnapped my daughter in public. And I didn't have the address of my child. None of these niggas that want to say something Travis now. Travis gave you the address, though? Travis gave me the address. Right. But as far as Meek Mills, no. Puff Daddy, whoever, none of these niggas. All you fake hard niggas, fuck you. Wait, Come, wait, no, no, wait. Hold on, hold on. Okay. All you fake hard niggas, fuck you. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. I'll get fuck who, because you can't shoot nobody. Gemini anymore. men Everybody can be very imbalanced, deal, which is probably you know why saying? Kim, That's a Libra, was able to keep him in balance for some years. If you ever plan on dealing with a Gemini, it is best to keep your emotions in check because they would rather not deal with it. They feel like they have enough going on in their minds to keep them preoccupied. Most of all, do not be predictable and do not try to take their freedom. And that includes their freedom of speech. So why does it seem like Geminis are having to eat their words lately? It is because they don't put action behind what they say. They feel like because they thought about it or because they said it, that that's enough. And it definitely ain't. Always remember, nobody is exactly the same as we all have control over our own individual actions. Astrology should be used as a self-help guide for manifesting what we want. Astrology should not be used for effery if you know what I mean. Never try to change anyone. Start with self and everything else will fall neatly into place. And the sooner the better. If you enjoyed the video, please like and share the video. Thanks for watching. And personal readings can be booked on our website at blackastrologyatl.com. You can also check out our merch. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and follow us on IG at Black Astrology Media. And you can also follow us at Black Astrology. Never gonna be the one turn on my brother when police has got to detain. And that's good for me because I'm a Sagittarius moon, honey. Yes, I am very into astrology.